Back in November 2006, Major Troy Gilbert was killed in Iraq um, in an F-16 crash. He has uh, two boys. During his memorial service, I just really felt the calling to do something for those boys. My dad passed away uh, June 27th of 2005. Definitely the most hardest thing I've ever been through in my life. All the counselors here are amazing. I can definitely see how they try to instill everything in us, the leadership they bring. And because you see them giving their time, it makes you want to give your time back to others. Uh, we're pilots in the 457th Fighter Squadron and uh, we all fly F-16s in that unit. I absolutely love every one of these boys, like they were my own sons. And so for me, it's, it's very simple. It has everything to do with honoring the men and women that have lost their lives. I can think of no greater way to honor that memory than to care for their children. Smoky Mountain Service Dogs. I told them stability was A number one for me because I had a couple of bad falls. Paired, ended up pairing me with Lucy. She's very special. I can put weight on her and she'll hold it. It's almost spooky how much she stares at you. <laughs> when the service dog becomes your dog, it's yours from then on to take care of each other. It's a great feeling. For Ambucks coming along three years ago, I had an opportunity to get a hand cycle. Got me back out outside again. I could go places that I couldn't go before. Our motto is independence and mobility. The grant from the Star Foundation was, uh, was just a fantastic thing. It's just going to enable us to uh, go out and, and select vets uh, around the Mid-South that we can give the bikes to. We're not a large uh, organization, but when the, that kind of money came in, we could automatically think that, well, you know, we're, we're going to be able to go out and give away eight to ten of these cycles to vets. It's a great feeling to know that I can go out there and know that it might be hard, but I can do it.